dogs. Do you see a dog? Where, right? Hmm. Good morning, friends. Happy Vlogmas Day 19. I cannot believe how close we are to the end of the year. Like, I cannot believe that. Day 19 of Vlogmas, like we're almost at the end. I can't believe I have made it this far. I'm quite proud of myself. A little bit of a bumpy ride this year, but mostly okay. I think we've done all right. We've done okay. Anyway, today is another day where we are out of the house by nine because the contractors are spending another full day here so they should be here from nine till probably five working on the place the stairs should be finished with what they're doing by the end of today that's what i was told the mirror for the basement is finally going in so they say they said that a few times now but i think today it's actually gonna happen so i'm thinking it should be good I'm thinking things are gonna get accomplished today and that feels good so i feel good leaving the house being productive going to my parents house you know having my dad cook me eggs for breakfast it's always a nice perk, you know, when someone else makes you food and you don't have to think about it. Big perks. I'm gonna head out in like two minutes. Actually, I should call a car now and then get myself together. So I have uh, I have my bag with everything in it and I think I'm also gonna bring like a little pack to lunch with me so that I don't have to feel like I'm just eating my parents' food. Not that they care, but I wanna bring something. I'm gonna bring this Trader Joe's kimchi and tofu soup. Very excited. Jill actually tried this recently in a vlog and she told me about it and I was like, oh my God, what are the odds? I actually picked this up when we went to Trader Joe's. So we're gonna bring this. We got our coffee and a little to-go cup today. Pretty delish. Yeah, I guess we're just gonna call a car now and then head out of here. And actually tonight I'm going back to the game board bar with Rachel, Sarah, and Annie. So that's gonna be super fun. That'll be later though, so it'll actually be after the guys are gone so i'll be able to come back here get myself ready and then head over there so that's kind of what's going on Oh, thank God. Praise Jesus. Praise. Oh, good morning, papas. Ready to take on the day. Ready to take on the day. Clink. Let's go over what's outstanding and what's not when you have a chance. Okay. <laughs> we just put my stuff down. Alrighty, righty, righty. Let's discuss. That was done. It was probably later. See a dog? Where are the dogs? Do you see a dog? Where, right? Hmm. Maybe a bunny? Where are the bunnies? Brace, do you see any? Maybe the ducks? Are the ducks outside? Yeah? Where? Mm -hmm. Okay, Brady, let's go to work. Let's get some things done. My 
my mother is making me try all of these snacks. It's only 10 a.m. I'm eating like barbecue crackers. They're so addicting, I can't stop. It just feels too early for like eating chips. It's 10 a.m. Also, not me <laughs> going for the day 18 coffee because today is day 18 and then acting as if it's day 19. Where's my head? I think it just goes to show the delusionalness that is where I'm at right now in the month. But happy Vlogmas day 18, not 19. That's tomorrow. Still okay. We're still, you know, chugging along. <laughs> Haven't given up yet. Have not given up yet. Will not give up. I feel like, you know, the middle of Vlogmas, there's just a little bit of holy shit. But then as you get closer to the end, it's like, oh, this is nice. This is fun. It's just um, how it goes. It's going to like be bittersweet at the end of this. It's going to be weird. But I did want to give a shout out to Case Defy because I put this new case on. I've gotten some questions about it. So this is my new case from Case Defy. I actually got a bunch of cases from them, but this is the one we have currently on the phone. Good things are coming. Just a nice little reminder to have next year when things are hard. <laughs> you guys know I love Case Defy. I work with them all the time. I'm so grateful for that. I think they're such a great company and they have the greatest cases. So many options, like so many personalized options. They're really protective of your phone, obviously. Never have to worry about dropping it or anything like that because I know they're safe. Actually, their new impact and ultra impact cases are made of 65% recycled and plant-based materials, which is awesome. Those cases are also 100% BPA-free, 100% non-toxic, non-hazardous, like none of none of the bad stuff. And they do have an antimicrobial coating that protects your phone from germs and bacteria and also kills the bacteria, which is great. Of course, I have a link for you guys to get 15% off. We love a little discount. Just go to casetify.com slash Michelle to get 15% off your new phone case. Link will be in the description if you want to check it out. It's always fun to treat yourself with a new case, right? I like, look how cute this is. I love it. And now I'm going to get into the work zone. I've been slightly distracted. La ti da ti da. Eggies. Eggie time. You already know who's ready for her eggies. Is Brady ready for eggies? She knows it's eggie time. She knows. What's our cheese of today? A tre fromage. Ah, oh, tre fromage. Yummy. We were on a long habanero. So we're switching it up today. Yes. Love it. Yum. Pro egg chef. Pro egg chef. <laughs> A chef, eh? And uh, let's get you a little forky. Got me, thank you. She knows what time it is. Look at her. Yeah, Look at your it. ear, Bubba. Oh. Jerry! <laughs> She's so funny. There she is. Oh. Oh, yes, of course. Yummy eggies. <laughs> Okay, no, I gotta eat. My turn. Yum. She just sits there and waits for my parents. It's so funny. It's been obviously a while. The day seems to be flying by. It's like 1.30 now. My parents have been out for the past bit, which means I've been able to get a lot of work done, which is nice. Just been on the couch getting some editing done, but they have been out trying to find a booster shot for themselves and they finally managed to find one. I don't know where they went, but I'm very happy, very relieved that they are getting their boosters today. Such I think they already got them. Obviously I will be getting as soon as it's available to me, but glad that they are covered and safe. Makes me very happy. Okay, back to it. Had to have a Brady break. How did it go? We are boosted. Woo! Boosted! Yeah, we're boosted. Brady, isn't that exciting? <laughs> now we just have to get you guys boosted. I know. Next week when it opens up again, I think we're 18 Right. Happy for you guys though. How's the arms feeling? So far, so good. Good, good, good. Very glad you guys are done and taken care of now. I know. For now. So happy. Yeah, well. No, I'm very tired. I'm not going to be able to socialize for another week. Okay. <laughs> His excuses, excuses. He's just like me. Okie dokie. What's today's What's choice? today's chocolate? It's not even chocolate. Okay. I know what I'm getting. 
I'm going into this. Ooh. I feel like that's what mom was gonna do. No. Nope. I think we should split them in half. Are you do you're going for red velvet? Yeah, well, because it's the only one. <laughs> I think I wanna do the pink guy, or I wanna try one of these. Yeah. You can try the one. I want to do the pink eye. Do the that pink was eye. so I good yesterday. God damn, it's the last one. <laughs> Would you like me to cut this in half? No, no, no. That's very kind and considerate of you, but you don't have to do that. Wow, look at this little guy. Maybe I want that in half. Well, I'm oh, sorry, I did an <laughs> offer. Did you want this in half? Maybe we should put it into... Maybe quarters. we do all of these in half. Let's cut all these oh, in thirds. First of all, we're not doing that. <laughs> okay. Aggression! That very aggressive. Ready? Cheers. <laughs> You're ready to start it. Put okay. them away. Another this is not red velvet. No. It's like cherry. Oh, no. Nah. There. You can have the other half. That's not cool. Look at this. I don't like that one. This is totally different Your than what I had yesterday. Well, look. Do they look all the same? No, I don't think so. Well, the texture's mm. all different. Like, everything's different about it. How's yours? Is yours vanilla? What is it? The does angel. it look like vanilla? It does. Or coconut? Oh. What is it? These little flakes. Coconut? There you go. Baby! Problem is, I'm used to this now. This level. Hey, babe. This level of richness. This level of amazingness. That's yeah. a problem. Mm-hmm. It's a big problem. Now the rest of our snacks in our house taste like dog shit in comparison. They're just not nearly as good for this. That. This is like different. Oh Brady, go in. Go oh, this in. This is special. I don't know how they make it so good. Everybody. I want else. another one. No. You can have another one. No. Another no, one. no, no. Yes. No. We'll savor the snacks. No way. What a day. That's what we're allowed. And if she's around, you're gonna have it. Not very horrible. That's not nice. I think we have to get these every Christmas. I think we should get them anytime we run out. I agree with that fact as well. It's dark out there. It's dark outside today. We're we're leaving the house now for a nice little stroll before it looks like the rain will come down. It's not coming down, is it? No. I'm gonna go for a nice walk with Brady and uh then we'll be back for some more work. What jacket may I steal today? This will, ooh, this is such a cute one, Mom. This is from Zara, right? Yep. So cute, oh my. You're coming home with me. <laughs> you know, you know. I can't believe it's like magic. It's magic. Unbelievable, really. What the hell are you doing? Making soup. It's actually a kimchi and tofu soup, Trader Joe's. Oh, look at you. I know. Pretty exciting, actually. It looks very good. I think TJ's is all hype, though. You're very wrong. Oh, the little baby. Oh, no. Oh, oh, bad thing no. has happened. The bad thing has happened. Take her away. Oh, wow. All right, First of all, this is a horrible mess you made. Wow. All right, to my bracelet. You lived a good life. Thank you for the good times. Okay, my soup. I think it's gonna be good soup. Good soup. Good soup. Also, my battery is flashing red, what which is very bad news mm -hmm. for me because I don't have another battery here. So, this looks good. All right, we're gonna do a little tasty test. Very hot. Got some nice heat, not too spicy. Pretty good. <laughs> Brady's got like daggers. You don't like this. This is not for you. I like it. It's good soup. Recording. Oh my god, I wasn't recording. It's fine. That is really nice. You like it? I like a lot. Yeah, it changes a lot. First of all, why? First of all, it looks much bigger. Now. It does. It looks so much bigger. Let's go mirror to this. Yeah. It looks really good. What's this red thing in the middle of the mirror? I hope to God. Yeah, it looks really nice. This is really nice. Okay, the red does come off. Let me show you guys the mirror. Look at that. This looks so bougie. Well, finally, there is a mirror down here. Let's see what else has happened. Well, you can see some things have occurred in some areas. Have occurred. Oh yes, you're right. This door looks like it's freshly painted. Yeah, what's going on in here? Oh yeah, we discovered they didn't even paint any of this room. So they are now painting. It actually looks like they painted. It's so. looking nice and crisp. Yeah, and they left their stuff here for tomorrow. We're in, we're gonna do a, a little scan around and then I will fill you guys in. All right guys, it is 6.15, my dad just left. We did a whole walkthrough. It feels like we're back in the day. <laughs> it feels really weird to do walkthroughs again, but I think things are actually getting finished, which feels really good. I have a very like, detail-oriented eye for like little things and I noticed that the color in the basement was like slightly off from the baseboards and I was like, did they not paint? So I told my contractor that and then to see paint on the walls, like I can't believe I was actually right because it was like maybe one shade 
different but i was like i feel like that's not the paint color of the rest of the house and i just can't believe i was right like how do you miss a whole basement to paint <laughs> either way it's getting done now i thought it was going to be finished today but then i got an email like a few hours ago from the contractor being like hey so they're going to come back again tomorrow and i think they're actually going to finish with all the other little dots they're finally getting taken care of so it'll be one more day at my parents house tomorrow it's actually been kind of nice going over there and spending the day there one more day and then i think we're just about done and that's so exciting i'm so happy to have a mirror in the basement now like to have that finally in that was like the last kind of big thing that needed to be taken care of and now that that's installed all the big stuff is done and now i just have to figure out how to furnish the place and uh then just enjoy the home, which is awesome. And once they're done tomorrow, I can get back into like the Christmas vibes and like put more stuff up. I, I wanna put more on the tree. Christmas is like right around the corner and it's not even like perfect the tree. I need to put like a tree skirt on there. Like there's a, there's a lot. I've done this very half-assed. I mean, half-assed, but also not half-assed. There's like shit everywhere, but it's not like perfect. Also, I am not going out in the end tonight because the girls needed to push it. So we are doing it another night. And that means I'm gonna have a nice chill night by myself at home, which I am always grateful for. I'm not gonna lie i love my nights to myself but i got a package from revolve my monthly revolve package i got a combination of things i got a bunch of dress options for new year's we're gonna try them all on and see what they're looking like i got a couple of winter things and then i also got some like tropical vacation vibe things although i'm not sure if there's gonna be any tropical vacation due to all of the things in the world i don't want to go into it because i'm very over it i'm very tired of it i'm tired of hearing it and seeing it everywhere so we're not talking about it but i don't know what i'm doing re-traveling right now so we'll see but we will still open up this package i have a big box i'm a little confused because i ordered a jacket that should be like the size of this box so i don't know what's actually in here oh i see the jacket okay maybe everything's in here okay the first thing Ooh. here is the first dress it's like velvety with a little cutout very smooth i think this guy is gonna be a little short okay so this is the dress on. I actually think it's really really comfy. It's really soft. It's obviously quite short like she's she's short short and I am 5'2 So keep that in mind if you are a taller lady or even just an average size lady This is a very short dress even for me. This feels like a little you know, like in a butt. I feel like if I do anything, my butt is exposed I will also link everything in the description in case you want to check anything out for yourself Everything will be in the description now. This is like a cute little wrap a little bikini cover-up. Cute. Then we have this dress. Look at that. How fun. Ooh, look at that color. This feels very Barbie New Year's. Like, this is just not me. It's like, never see myself in shit like this. So when I wear it, it's just like, what the fuck? But I think it's nice. I like it. I got a new pair of shorts. I haven't gotten any new shorts in a long time. I mean, obviously it's winter, but perfect little denim shorts from Girlfriend. Love it. I figured I would get myself a fresh pair if I am going somewhere warm. Okay. Oh, I'm pretty sure this is a scarf. It is a scarf. Oh, ooh. A nice scarf. See, we're moving into the winter things. Love it. Oh my. Oh, another dress. Look at the color. This is so pretty. Okay, this is so pretty, but there's something about it that's giving me like 13 going on 30. I don't know why, but it's definitely super pretty. Another dress. Okay, this is more orange than anticipated. Thought it was gonna be like a brown, but still really nice. Okay, honestly, I love this one a lot more than I anticipated. I feel like it looks really nice on. Perfect length for me. I just feel like it fits super nice. Love the sparkles, you know, for the New Year's vibe. I like this one a lot, actually. Okay, this top, wait, how does it go? Okay, the camera keeps dying, but we are making it through. Look at this little top. It is a little strappy thing. I'm just picturing Mexico. <laughs> Guys, okay, I didn't think this top was gonna be as small as it is. I should have I should have known better. I am obviously not wearing this top in Toronto right about now. That's just not gonna happen, but look at the back. Like there's not a whole lot of material happening here, but you know what? I think it's cute. Got a little tube top. Think it would look very nice with a tan? I really hope I get to go away. I'm just a little nervous about the world right now. This is kind of a funny look, you know, Christmas vibes and then like vacation vibes. I feel like I haven't seen myself look like this for a minute. Anyways, the shorts are great. Love this little tube top. And I feel like with the tan, it'll look so good. This just looks so funny though. Whoa, how do you wear this? Okay, well this is like another strappy top. 
and it's just the strap. This is all you got. This little chain. How fun. How does this work? Wait, do you go like this? Okay, I'm not sure who I think I am picking out these tops. From the front, this looks totally super cute and cash and fine. The back. Where is it? I mean, obviously I knew there was gonna be no back, but like, who did I think I was ordering this? I like it, like I'm into it, but I don't know where this came from. It fits shockingly nice, like feels supportive. I don't, I don't feel super exposed, shockingly enough, considering I am very exposed. <laughs> this is for a vacation that I hope I can take. This is so pretty, look at this dress. I feel like this dress deserves a vacation. Like it just deserves it, you know? Like not for me, but for the dress. For the pina colada. We will see. Oh, here's another dress for New Year's. I feel like this is a very classic New Year's dress. Okay, I feel like this one is so flattering. I don't know what's happening here, but I like it. It actually cinches down here so you can kind of make it longer or shorter depending on what you want. But it's just a nice classic halter dress, you know, kind of New Year's Eve sparkles. And then this, I think is a romper. It's definitely a romper, but I'm gonna have to tie it up. I don't know if you can see what's happening here. Okay, here's the romper on. I actually think it's really cute. I'm not sure about the bow in the front here. I'd maybe try and tie it in the back, but so cute. Again, imagining a tropical vacation with like a little dinner, a girl can dream. And last but not least, the coat. Here she is. I'm gonna have to try it on to get the full look, but there's like this leather belt. I am a large teddy bear. I feel like it's usually hard for me to find good fitting long coats because I'm so short, but let me try and do this with the belt. I think it's still cute. Like it'll keep me warm, which is important. Um, I don't know. And that was the haul. Thank you so much Revol for all of the goodies. Let me know in the comments which dress you would wear for New Year's. Let me know. And now I'm going to put on Pajamas? I was gonna say put on comfy clothes, but I'm in comfy clothes. I'm gonna put on pajamas. Now that I know that I'm in for the night, I'm going to start chillaxing. All right, friends, we have gotten nice and comfy for the evening now. We have sweats, we have Vlogmas merch, we have dirty ass hair. I'm gonna make some dinner in a little bit. I think I'm gonna go through my Pinterest boards actually and look at the things that I've pinned for food and like make something yummy. But I kind of want to just like chill out for the rest of the day, stop talking and just like throw on my TV. So I'm actually gonna do that and I am gonna end the vlog here. I hope you guys enjoyed watching it. I love you so much. I can't believe this is like the end of day 18. I thought it was day 19, but it's not day 19, it's 18. It's honestly crazy how close we are to Christmas at this point, so crazy. I'm so excited my brother's gonna come back for Christmas Eve and we are gonna do our now annual Christmas cocktail competition. We did it for the very first time last year and it was so fun. I think even Carter and Matthew were gonna come um, we're gonna make it a whole thing and I'm super excited. Once this is all wrapped up tomorrow, I'm going to regroup and figure out what I wanna do for decorating. I wanna figure out what to do with that painting. Some people are saying that I should paint over it and do something that matches the vibe. Is that really bad? Please let me know in the comments if that's morally wrong. I know this is like a mass produced painting, but it still feels wrong to go over someone else's work. Like, I don't, I don't know, but people are suggesting it. Let me know your stance on that. I really don't know. But I actually have an idea of what should go in that space now, which is helpful to figure out what the rest of the space needs to look like. I'm actually starting to form an image in my head. So the next step is to find pieces online that match the image that I can put together in a mood board. When I do that, I will definitely vlog it. I always get people asking me how I do those. Working on that, I'm probably gonna do a little bit of Googling tonight, looking at furniture, see if anything catches my eye. I like to compile a list of things that I like and then see what goes. Anyways, we're gonna talk about this in full extent another day. So I'm just sitting here rambling, but I hope you guys have had a fantastic day or night or morning or whatever. Hope you guys enjoyed today's vlog and I will see you guys tomorrow again for another day at my parents' house with little baby Brady. Also, I wanna say I die when you guys send me like on Instagram pictures of your dogs freaking out to Brady or just watching Brady. It makes me so happy, I cannot tell you. It's actually so, I'm gonna continue to ramble because I feel like talking right now. It's actually crazy to me when I see Instagram stories from you guys like watching the vlogs on your actual TV or just like on your computer or wherever you watch them. It's just wild to see my video that I just like in my head, I just like, I'm just here editing a little video of my day together on my computer, but I don't really, I can't like acknowledge the reach. I can't wrap my head around it and I've never been able to wrap my head around it. It just feels wild. So when I actually see my videos in your home, it's like, what? <laughs> like I, I just can't believe it. I really can't believe 
any of it. I'm just a girl sitting in a house talking to people on the internet. But I don't, I don't know. The whole thing is, I will never be able to explain the, the feeling ever, but I am so grateful. And it's just so cool. So thanks for having me be like a part of your day or whatever. It's awesome. It's mind blowing. It's crazy, <laughs> but thank you. Seriously, it's unbelievable. But I love you guys so much. Have a great rest of your day again, and I will see you tomorrow. Bye. This is